Now, as far as the casement window goes, the way that it operates is fairly simple, and most people are familiar with it because a lot of people have had it in their house. Now, oftentimes I'll go into houses and I'll have people say, no, I don't want a casement window. We've had nothing but problems with the ones that we had. The problem is that people are going into this with their knowledge and not ours. You need to know that we pick the best manufacturer, the best windows, and we have some unique technologies that nobody else has that makes it more easy to use. Plus, we offer a lifetime warranty on everything that you see here. So the frames, the sashes, the locks, the cranks, all of it. If there's any issues, we're even including the labor in it. We're not going to charge you to come and fix it. We cover the parts, we cover the labor, all included. Now, as far as the mechanics go, everything here is made in Canada, actually right here in Toronto. With this window, the only thing that's not made in Canada is the actual hardware itself. We use the Roto system. I'll get into that a little bit more. Now, for the window itself, if you look down here, this little mechanism right here, the crank that opens the window, with a tier one or a two two upgrade, it actually locks in place so that it doesn't flop all over the place while you're cranking your window. It eliminates smashing your knuckles, makes it a little bit stronger, eliminates a lot of the wear and tear that your kids have put on it. Um, it is adjustable if you need to adjust it, but ultimately the window, you unlock it like this, open it like so. Now the window itself will open up to a full 90 degrees. Can you get a shot of the, the window from a little bit closer this way and get it from the other side as well? So the screen itself, nice, the screen itself is spring loaded. So you can push down from the top or on the sides. The screen comes right out, makes it super easy to clean. You can clean this side of the window. You can clean this side of the window. Even for a big guy like me with big arms, they have the window offset just a bit so that you can actually get your arm outside. Uh, it makes it much easier to clean for the second floor windows. You don't need to be on a ladder if you, if you don't have to be. Now, as far as the mechanics go, if I can get you to come in just a little bit closer and zoom in on this. So when I, when I move this lock mechanism, this bar system moves up and down. Now that's not so unique to us. A lot of companies are going with this route and that enables it for it to hit three to four points on the window on the side to make sure that everything locks nice and tight. You've got three seals in between the inside and the outside. And then there's one on the bottom of the window as well. But what's unique to us is this lock system with the tier one or the tier two upgrade, when I open it, we actually lock it in on the top of the window as well. So the reason that they do that is because over time, typically what happens with the casement windows and one of the biggest issues that people have is that the bottom is always gonna close because it's got the heavy duty hardware on the bottom that's always gonna pull shut. But for most companies, the top of the window is where the problems happen. Your house is always settling. If it's not installed properly inward or outward, if everything's not completely square, what happens is the top doesn't close properly and then you need to fix your window or you need to replace your window again much sooner. This ensures that regardless of what your house does, every Everything seals nice and tight. It also locks it in at the top so that when it gets those really strong gusts, when there's any issues, if the house settles, um, it just locks everything in nice and tight for a longer period of time. So that 25 years from now, when you still have the windows, if you still own your house, then everything closes nice and tight still. Now, as far as the warranty goes that I mentioned, it does cover all of the parts of the window. It covers the hardware. Depending on the size of the window will depend on the casement crank size that we use. These arms are stainless steel, they're powder coated so they won't rust, they won't deteriorate. Um, and if there is any issues, like I said, fully covered. It's guaranteed not to come out of the bottom track so that those are typically the only issues that people have. So they've thought ahead with all of that and, and made everything nice and strong. Everything works really great. And as it closes, you'll see that it's the black on the outside. Now watch what happens when I put the window in. See how it sucks tight in at the top there? That's what I was talking about. So everything looks good.